Good evening and a very warm welcome to this week's Out and About. On the 14th of January every year, the Indian community world over get together to celebrate the auspicious occasion of Uttarayan, the famous kite festival which is known by different names across different states in India. In Gujarat and Maharashtra, it's known as Makar Sankranti. In Assam, it's known as Bihu. And of course, in the south of India, it's known as Pongal. And in today's show, we'll be bringing you a variety of Pongal celebrations. The first of which is at SOAS University in London. <laughs> Because we don't live in our country, um, so definitely we miss everything back home. So not only us, it like so many Tamil communities here celebrate Diwali, Pongal and everything. But when it comes to Tamil, Pongal is definitely one of the very important festivals that we celebrate. And the connection with uh, the Thiruvallur statue here is really really more for all of us because the Tamil Studies UK is going to be happening here and also we have this beautiful statue so every year we come over here and do a bit of a celebration but then this year we thought why not let's just make a pongal so we will be uh, having lots of columns going on and then we are going to make pongal live and uh, so many celebrities are coming I mean uh, the MPs and from political leaders are coming and then they there's going to be uh, more cultural events are happening. So this is something like, you know, uh, we do this not to miss our hometown. So this is absolutely amazing for all of us to gather together and do whatever we do back home. Yeah, the, so we are here in uh, SOAS University of London, just in front of the Thiruvallur statue. You know, he's a very famous poet. And the uh, Tamil community here in Britain are celebrating now because the London Assembly has uh, declared this January as Tamil Heritage Month. So Tamil is the harvest, uh, uh, sorry, January is the harvest uh, uh, month for Tamils and uh, almost most of the Indian community. So the Tamil community today here assembled to do Thai Pongal, which is the harvest celebration event, as well as the honoring the statue. So we usually every year come here to garland the statue in, Jan in the month of January.
SOAS is a university with an existing history in the field of Tamil studies. Tamil was one of the first languages offered here when the institute was founded over a century ago. Uh, Tamil is well represented here. We have the famous Tiruvalluva statue. It's a popular um, site not only for the Tamil community here in the UK, a focal point for the community, but also for the student community. Uh, there's not a single student who doesn't look forward to that moment when they can graduate and take their photo with the Tiruvalluva statue. Well, it's fantastic to be at SOAS for Pongal. It's a wonderful event for the Tamil community. So I'm an, an Assembly member uh, and the London Assembly back in December unanimously passed my motion calling on the Mayor, calling on the boroughs of London to recognise uh, Tamil Heritage Month. Uh, we are so grateful for all the work that the community, uh, the Tamil community does in London, whether it's in care homes, in hospitals, in the armed forces, in our schools. We know that you've worked really hard, especially throughout the, uh, the awful years of, of the pandemic. So we're very grateful and I wanted to make sure that that work was recognised um, and that we could celebrate um, Tamil Heritage Month along with you. Did they, tam did, did they, did, did they, tam did, did they. Well, huge congratulations to the entire SOAS Tamil community for putting on those celebrations. Now, I think it's fair to say no Pongal celebration is complete without a proper vegetarian Pongal feast, typically served on a banana leaf. So let's head over to Gopal's Corner in Victoria to find out more. <music> We are celebrating Pungal here. Yeah? It's a Thai Pungal. It's our Tamil festival. It's a harvest festival. Um, we try to thank the sun, the harvest, the farmers, everyone. And we're trying to bring all the culture together. The only way to connect people is with the food. So we were serving the food the way we normally eat back home. Serving banana leaf and uh, table service. The real thing here is that we bring the community together. This is a Malaysian Tamil restaurant. Um, and so the food here, uh, you will see enjoyed by not just the Tamil community, but the Malay and the Chinese community from Malaysia as well. And because we're located in Market Hall, it's a very diverse place. Uh, so everybody from all walks of life are coming in here, enjoying vegan vegetarian cuisine.
Well, it is very important to connect with the community uh, because we come abroad and hardly we can find something like this for us to join and do something. So this is the only way we can connect with the people and bring the culture in. So educate the people how we celebrate and let the world know how, what is Pongal all about. Well, I can confirm that absolutely was as delicious as it looked. Time to take a very short break now, but there's much more Pongal celebrations coming your way in part two. So we'll see you again in a few moments time. <music>